Let's get it. Man, I swear I love my squad. I love my team. I love my team. All I know my bros loyal. These walls loyal. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to make a simple enchilada um, that you do not have to put in the in the oven. So first you have to buy hamburger meat. Make sure you buy um, your hamburger ground beef. The carne molida. And then you wash your hands before. I already washed my hands, oh. And you put your ground beef in the pan. Then you need to get a spoon. Let that cook a little bit. And with your wooden spoon, I use a wooden spoon, you're gonna smash it. And add seasoning to it. Oh, there's my coconut oil. I'm gonna use um, a seasoning salt that I have. you just put as much as you like because some people like more than others and you wait till that gets brown so usually I make my own sauce but since I'm lazy right now <laughs> and I had no time I went and bought this sauce the Las Palmas sauce enchilada sauce for those who don't know how to make their salsa or their chili sauce for enchilada sauce uh, so you just dump it in the pan preheat your pan and then while your um, meat is cooking still you still have to brown it more make sure all the red is gone and in the back, you preheat your your um, oil. You're gonna put the, the you're gonna get a tortilla. You know, put it in the oil. Let it kind of submerge in the oil. Then you take it out. And you put it in the sauce. Then you get the spatula. You kind of like leave it in the oil. Submerge it. Submerge it. <laughs> then you take it out. Kind of drip how it. And you put it on here then you're gonna get some um you're gonna get uh ground beef, ground beef. what is uh, what do i call it um it was carne molida hamburger meat and you're gonna put it on top here then you get some green onions you put it on top here then you do it again and you just submerge it inside of the oil make sure your oil is really hot this is the easy, simple, fast, fast, quick way to, flat enchiladas. to make flat enchiladas. And then you put in the oil and the sauce. And then you submerge it in the sauce. Let it drip a little bit. Put it on here. And depending on how much, um, how many the person wants is how many you do. So I'm not going to, oh, wait, I've got the cheese. And that's it. that's it. You kind of just keep doing it and keep doing it until you're done. So this one is going to be for my oldest son. So I'm going to make him three because he loves to eat. So then you just do that. Put it in the sauce. Let it cook in the sauce a little bit. Drip it out and put it over. And then... You, since that's the last one, you're gonna want to um, get more cheese. Sprinkle the cheese on top. Then you get your green onion and put it on top. Then for You're gonna get, get us some crem, crema, some sour cream. Kind of Mexican tool, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so you put the topping on. Necesita poner la crema arriba. And then you put where the looks, and you are done. 
And what is this, man? It I... is uh, my grandma's famous enchiladas. My grandma actually taught me how to make these enchiladas when I was a little girl. They're fast, easy, simple, fast. If you need something to make fast, it's fast and easy. And you got a dinner. Let's get it. Man, I swear I love my squad. I love my team. I love my team. All I know my bros loyal. These walls loyal.